Hello and welcome back to more Dishonored. We're going to be taking a look at uh, the, not the first DLC, but the second DLC. I'm pretty sure this one is just Trials, as the name implies. We've been doing The Knife of Dunwall. And looking at the PC Gaming Wiki, apparently there's a place where it can crash. I've already forgotten what place it was. So. That, that's caught on me. Uh, unlocking a new difficulty mode is automatically saved in your user settings. Oh, it loaded up a new menu. A new game, I guess. Oh, it's difficulties. Okay. Yeah, let's go with veteran. I think I know what I'm doing in Dishonored. None like her. You can't forget what you've done. Killing the Empress and handing her daughter Emily to the Lord Regent haunts you. Oh my! Oh, is that is that what the DLC is? Job shouldn't have mattered. My playing is doubt. I killed nobles before. You could float a whaling ship, and the highborn blood I've spilled. Another noble steps in to replace the last one. All equally corrupt. Why should an empress be different? But she was. I watched her bodyguard's face as they took him away. Dead eyes. I knew I'd pay for this one. Maybe I deserved to. A storm was coming that would shake apart everything I'd built. I'm in the outsider's place. Actually, I don't know what this place is called. Um, what should I call it? The outside? Yeah, it's called the outside. I mean, it's the place where the outsider is, where I find the outsider, so it's the outside. Uh, the power blink, yeah, I know how to blink. I know what I'm fucking doing. The, uh, the way my vision changes is different from uh, Corvo. I like this carriage. It speaks to me. Wow, I can't jump for shit. Hold on, let me try and run. Huh? It's slightly better. I'm still disappointed. Dowd, my old friend. It's been a long while, but you've got my interest again. How the years pass and the bodies fall. Did you know that there are only eight like you in the world bearing my mark? I'm here I didn't know that. You're right. The Empress was different. This time, 
You can't just fade away into the shadows. There will be consequences. Your story is close to ending, and even you can't escape it. But what ending will you make for yourself? I'm here to give you one last gift, Dowd. It's a mystery. One that starts with a name. Delilah. The evening talk, the evening radio talk show host? Is that Delilah? Am I supposed to find love advice from her? <laughs> uh, I, just, I just hope some of you get that reference. Uh, let's see. A captain of industry. Bundry Rothwild is a ruthless businessman who owns a slaughterhouse and a fleet of whaling ships, including a ship called the Delilah. Oh, well, that answers my question. Not a evening, evening radio talk show host. Infiltrate the Rothwild slaughterhouse and find out what's behind the name. For six months, the city writhed and changed. For six months, I tried to forget what I'd done to the Empress and her little girl. But there was no forgetting. I needed to find my next move. But all I had was that name. Delilah. Who was she? A threat? Oh, an ally. Word came from my second-in-command, Billy Lurk. In a house built on secrets. Lurk was especially good at uncovering them. There was a ship called the Delilah. It hunted whales for Bundry Rothwild. A former deckhand who'd made good. Now he owned a slaughterhouse, and he ran his workers like a prison gang. A ship named Delilah. Could be a coincidence, but it's not. In Dunwall, things are always tangled up like a bag of snakes. Who would put snakes in a bag? Favors. As Dowd, you can use your network of spies and corrupt merchants to purchase equipment and upgrades before each mission. You can also pay for special favors. These favors can have a variety of effects in the mission, such as granting access to equipment caches or revealing secret information. Well, I'm going to go for upgrades. Although, what do favors do? Oh. Well, look at that. Get a rune. Let's get that. Okay. Let's see. Of course, I'm going for killing as little as possible, as with the main campaign. Choke dust. What's that? Hmm. All right, spent my money. Down. You're here. I got bored, so I started without you. Turns out we're here on the perfect day. There's a strike at the plant, and it's no wonder. Rothwild runs this place like a prison. The stupid workers can't even get in without a time card. When the strike started, the butchers confiscated all the cards they could find. 
They've given the City Watch free reign to use force. If you ever wondered why I wanted out of the slums, here's your answer. There'll be other ways in, I'm sure of it. You don't mind if I tag along, right? Just to keep an old man safe. What are you calling old? I found something for you. I know you collect these. I'll be on the rooftops till you need me. Great room. Go on. Get off the property or we'll lock you up too. You have to give me back my time card. I can't get back in. You had no right to take it. Try and get past me, and I'll see you swinging from a meat hook. Jesus. Go home, mister. Orders are to confiscate those cards. No exceptions. I hope you die weeping. All of you. I hope the plague gets you. Hmm. All right, what can I spend my first rune on? So I have some slightly different powers. Oh. Time is frozen while you aim if you aren't moving. Hmm. Uh, I probably don't want to get agility first. Yep. All right, let me get to the main entrance over there. What exactly are my objectives? Uh, enter the slaughterhouse. Optional find a time card. more months. Uh, let's see. Void gaze. Uh, let's see. You press left mouse button to see in the dark and help you locate bone charms and runes. This power equipped, the mark of the outsider on Dowd's hand will light up when you are facing a bone charm or a rune. Okay, so that's what it does instead of the heart. Can I see enemies with it? Oh, wait, can I do it at level two? Yes, I need level two. Okay, I'm gonna want to rush that. How did it pass me by? <clears throat> All the others. Down the should we gather for whiskey and cigars tonight? Indeed, I believe so. Okay, here he comes. Man, I'm already feeling nervous about the fact that I can't see through walls. It's a really handy thing to be able to do, to see people through walls. 
All right, uh, the Leviathan Sorrow. Excerpt from a report on treaties banned by the Red Shore Count Trade Council. Little is known of Pacotti, credited with the series of pamphlets arguing against the whaling trade. While he is gifted, his views are nonsense and threaten the economic up underpinnings of the empire. 1. Enslavement on the breeding and husbanding of whales versus hunting the beasts in the wild after. A natural and free life cycle. Cody offers no solutions for where these massive malevolent creatures might be pastured. 2. Dissolution. Laments on the destruction of social bonds between herd members. Pakoti actually uses the term families. 3. Harmony. Drivel on the aesthetic wonder of what is in reality the great and terrible ocean that ever threatens to swallow us. It includes arguments on the gentle nature of the brutes. An ocean refuted by seamen who returned to shore, wide-eyed with tales of the whale savagery. 4. Disruption. Here, Pacotti is on his weakest footing, issuing a feverish warnings against the displacement or transference of natural beasts from their native environments. Go up. Also, the railing on the banister is solid. Uh. <clears throat> Fuck, there's a guy over there. I hear him. Oh no, is he is he down? Fucking hell. My headphones have failed me. Your own squad after what happened last night? Whoop, nope, there he is. I was wrong. He's over there. <clears throat> God, I hate not being able to see through walls. don't think he actually comes in here. But I think he's going to walk back over that way again. Things are bad. Could the city get any worse? Yeah. Of course. All right, come here, buddy. Sit tight right here. What's this? Oh, somebody's... Looks like they stenciled on the Empress. Blood from the eyes. I'd like to keep my eye blood, thank you. So what's this? Rat poison. We need to rid the sewer of the rat infestation. Make sure you set this crate of potted meat aside so we can lace it with rat poison. After it is poisoned, take it down to the dock so we can get it into the sewers below. There's that thing. <clears throat> I 